Well, all this month we are visiting the hometown South Dakota restaurants that you say we need to check out. For months now, and I mean months, you have told us that we needed to go to Yankton and check out a place called Charlie's Pizza House. Mm. Well, we did. <laughs> Before you see Charlie's Pizza, you smell it, and it is a good smell. The sign out front proudly proclaims that Charlie's has been serving Yankton since 1959. And right as you walk through the front door, you see the pizza-making crew working in a sort of synchronized dance. We were there on a Monday night, and the place was packed, and the phones were ringing. During a busy rush, there's a lot of moving pieces that you can't always keep your hands on, and I got a a pretty good crew up here that I trust. Nick Johnson is the shift manager at Charlie's. He's worked here for 14 years, and the other two guys on his pizza-making crew have been here nearly as long. For Nick, this isn't just a job at a pizza place. It has ended up being something a lot more than that. I think we're kind of lucky because this has been here since 1959, and everyone just knows it. You can't go through Yankton without trying Charlie's Pizza House, and we're happy to be, be a part of it. If you need proof, meet Mary Lou Anderson, who describes herself as a loyal Charlie's customer. We are. We were here last night. When we asked Mary Lou what it is about Charlie's that brings her here for two nights in a row, she told us there is just something about the pizza they make here. It's just, it's the crust that it has kind of a garlic uh, sauce on the outside of it, and it's awesome. And to further underscore Mary Lou's love for this place, you need to know that the night we talked to her was her 52nd wedding anniversary. Wayne is her husband. We moved here in 1969. So when you do the math, you realize Wayne and Mary Lou have been coming to Charlie's for 48 years. We've eaten pizza since 1962 all over the Midwest, all over the West Coast, and this is the best of all. So, what makes Charlie's Pizza so delectable? I don't know. I, I think a lot of it has to do with that oven. With all that cheese and the tasty sauce and the garlic, how could it be the oven that makes the big difference? I remember a long time ago I had someone tell me that uh, never throw away like an old cast iron skillet because you're just throwing away a, just a, a, a slew of flavor. The oven, the ingredients, the giant outside mural of Marilyn Monroe, it all joins up to make Charlie's a well-known, well-loved Dakota diner. We get a lot of loyal customers and it's just an institution in Yankton. Oh, do people love that place. The folks at Charlie say their business booms this time of year because of all the people who spend part of their summer at Lewis and Clark Lake. Okay, next Monday night on KSFY News at 6, we're going to Tulare to tell you about Aunt Mimi's Farmhouse Kitchen and the unique business model it's using to help boost the rural economy in Spink County. Well, gee, now I wish Charlie's was closer <clears throat> than 50 uh, minutes away. Right, Doesn't that good. sound good it's for good. dinner? I, I've eaten there. It's good. Very it's good. It's awesome. Yeah. It's so good. All right.